hell. I just wanted to mute my mic, but I ended up muting all of my audio. So you, I just realized you guys didn't have any music to listen to. So that's great. And then I kept dropping my phone and probably almost broke it. Alright. Speaking of audio levels and stuff, I think my mic's in a good spot. I'm not gonna be yelling today, I don't think. Unless some real bullshit happens. Which it might. This is Civ. Okay. launch this bitch up. Big loud in a second here. Can't stop it. Wish I could. I can stop that one though. Man, Civ does something to my PC. Alright. Uh, let's do this. Are you going to record for me? Did I tab out at the wrong time? No, we're good. I think. Yeah. Alright. Back into it then. Uh, let's do... So I think I was just about to go to war with Israel. And by that I mean the stream is aptly named. For an Uncharted 4 song, that was actually pretty, uh, tame. And all these, uh, units are all who care about the Grand Temple and the camp about those. Yeah, all the Aztec stuff is kind of obsolete now, but that's fine. I, uh... Oh, god. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll be worrying about that in a bit. Gifted unit to your event. Oh yeah, I did do that. And I have all this faith and nothing to do with it. It's very unfortunate, again, that I didn't get a religion, but... Also unfortunate that the Aztec bonuses are all pretty much gone, but uh, I definitely made good use of them in the early game, so I think we're fine, and I'll continue to use my overwhelming military presence to at least take this half of the continent, but probably eventually the whole thing. Uh, these guys got vassalized by Russia yesterday, which is something that really bothers me. Um, and then I was looking at my next policy tree here. Uh, and I think I was going to take this one, or sorry, this one. I'm just looking, because uh, I've, okay, I know what progress and tradition do, but they're more for early game stuff. And I ended up just going military focus. Like, I don't care about a settler anymore, I don't, or wait, no, sorry, they did give me a settler. I don't care about a worker anymore. I don't really care about all this stuff. Um... Yeah, I'm not focused on religion at all. Monasteries with faith, yeah. 
I was focused on religion until it was taken away from me. But I think I'm actually going to go a very, or play a pretty diplomatic game, especially with the city-states. Um, from here on out, because I did everything I needed in terms of my military already. Now it's just kind of cleaning up. So yeah, I think statecraft is the way to go. Uh, so what does it start with? One y one of every yield in capital for every 20 citizens of my empire. Oh, and I'm growing like crazy, so this is going to be nice. Uh, one gold in every city. Lo yeah, lots of gold. Lots of city-state trait. I think that's just what I gotta do. Very interesting. Okay then. Uh, shift and alliance, plague looming, yeah, yeah. And I made a village there. I'm probably about at the point where I'm gonna put my workers on auto build, but... Uh, well, you know what, I guess I can start now. Do your thing, workers. Oh, except I don't really want you to go over here. Maybe after the conquering of Jerusalem here, I'll uh, put them on automate. Because I want to burn the city down still, and I'm not sure if I want this one yet. Perhaps? Oh yeah, and then I have two more iron for a long swordsman. Unfortunately, I don't have machinery yet, so... I don't know, maybe I'll wait for machinery before I take on Jerusalem. How much uh, damage do these crosswomen do? 19? I feel like that's probably pretty useful here. And their uh, cityscape is a lot more open than it used to be, so I can actually shoot this time. Oh, this is Halo Reach music? Okay. Uh, let's see. I'm just thinking about what moves I want to make. Oh yeah, I was going to keep this guy here to see where Russia settles, because inevitably I'm going to be going to fight them again, especially if they're going to settle, like... Well, I imagine it's going to be somewhere in this region. Which is a really annoying, actually. Um, I have a feeling they want this iron, is my guess. So the, if they were smart, they'd probably pop a city down, like here. Maybe they'll just do it right on the spices, too, or the cinnamon, I don't know. We'll see. Um, okay. So in what, 15 turns or so, probably we'll do. Uh, we'll go to war here. We'll wrap him up, and then we'll try to take on the Celts again. I have a feeling that'll go pretty well. I don't know if I'm going to be able to take their capital, but we'll sure as hell get uh, these cities knocked out. And I'll also have my first coastal city, so that'll be nice. Um, then again, at this point, I'm not sure. Maybe I will want to keep this city. It has a lot of iron in it. I just don't know. Maybe I do. Ah, screw it. Let's, let's keep the city. Um, it seems my empire is able to contain a lot of cities here. I think this one I'm going to burn down. I don't need the faith. I guess the golden age points are alright, but... Uh, I might burn Cardiff too. Or maybe I'll burn this one, I don't know. I think this will be my border city with the Arabians here. Um, just trying to figure out what functions is a part of my empire here. I think we're okay. You know what? We'll just uh, we can give you a promotion. Sure. We want some stronger units over here. This is the Russian front. And you too, why not? 
Uh, what's the next upgrade past Long Swordsman, by the way? Probably Musketmen, right? Or Tercio, even? Is it Musketmen? Or oh, apparently they're archery units. That's interesting. Okay, so Tercio is probably the next one, then. Okay. Or Tercio? I don't know how to pronounce that. In any case, uh, let's get guys here. And I guess, yeah, the plan is to go and, uh, hold on. Is this music loud? I feel like the music's on the louder side, but maybe not. I don't know. Okay, uh... Yeah, if these guys basically call me out on wanting to invade them, I'll just invade them at this point. Uh, yeah, go there, go there. I noticed these guys were also kind of stacking up on my borders, but, you know, good luck if they want to do that. I think I let the Russians settle whatever city they're going to settle, and then I'll just go to war with them again. I don't know why they're, I mean, I know why they're settling over here, but diplomatically or, or whatever, if they, I've taken two of their cities already, they, I don't see why they'd want to anger me further. They know I'm capable of fighting them, but I guess they just don't care. And we're only friends now, but I'm sending emissaries over, right, so. Okay. Um, in that case, I think I'm going to annex the city finally. This is the first one I took, I'm pretty sure. And then we'll get a courthouse going maybe after the forge. Then a library, and I remember getting some bonuses from arenas too, so. But yeah, let's see. Maybe I can threaten them a bit with this uh, eagle. I don't even know how many long swordsmen I'm throwing at this problem, but 57%. Jeez, okay. Well, we are getting the courthouses up, but that is a problem for sure. I guess that is a pretty good, uh, oh my god, what? Oh, we love the king day ended because of, um... Something started at the other other day. I can't remember what it was. In any case, we'll keep moving here. How many of these guys are we gonna have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, yeah, so we'll leave the rest of our army over here. Uh, maybe get it more bordering the Celts. I'm not sure which city I want to take first. I guess probably this one, right? So once everyone's healed, we'll kind of get them over here. I'm really trying to, like, steer them away from settling over here, but I don't think I can just do that. And even Eagle Warriors will be decent against the Celts, I think, so... We'll leave you as a guard for this area. Just in case. Um, for all I know, the whole world will declare war on me eventually. I wouldn't be surprised. And then, yeah, we'll have two knights going from this side, or two long swordsmen. You can just chill. Getting that tech next turn. We're making quite a bit of culture, too. Apparently, I'm in a golden age. Yeah, okay. I'm liking where we're at. I will say, managing workers is not as bad, uh, I think, with this mod, because they tend to take longer to get things done.
These guys want an eagle now. Uh, market day has begun, and the city's marketplace is filled with customers. Uh, okay, so I get plus two gold for 30 turns. That's cool. I'd, I clearly don't need it, but I appreciate it nonetheless. My production is so high that I don't even really need the gold. Uh, okay, and we're on to machinery. I can also build trebuchets, which are actually quite good. Um... kind of starting to snowball and get out of control here, because I'm literally just running out of things to produce with how much uh, gold I have. can just build all the wonders, I guess. I have no idea. Oh, I need to finish tradition to do that, hey? Plot hill feature water. I need to be near... A river, I guess? Which, I mean... Oh yeah, I don't know if I have any cities built on a hill. Interesting, though. Huh. Okay, well, we're getting happiness back up here. I think it's because... Well, actually, I have no clue why. Oh, I did just finish the courthouse here, I suppose. That'll help. Uh, Prague wants an eagle. I can send them an eagle. Here, Prague, uh, take my eagle. We'll give you, uh, we'll give you this one. He's less promoted. And we'll send the rest of them down here. Just gonna keep trying to get in front of them here. Put off that city being settled as long as possible. I suppose, like, here wouldn't be the worst spot to set. Oh, well, actually, that's pretty bad. But maybe, I don't know, like, here... In the middle of the oasis and the wheat and all that. Could be a good spot, I suppose. Okay, uh, let's send you in. I can't believe we don't have another great general. I fought just like a huge war against Russia and didn't get one. And I'll just kind of set up here. And we can emissary Prague here. We'll be allies again, which is awesome. And they're gonna love the unit that I send. So I'm sure we'll be in good, good graces with them. Uh, speaking of emissaries, honestly, I think I'm just gonna have you keep building them. I think you'll be the emissary city that just pumps those out. And I can build a... Uh, how about we do this? Yeah. Good. And then who else am I in the... Okay, Valletta. I think of Valletta I was planning on killing at one point, but honestly, like, I don't really see the point anymore. Uh, also, I think I want to stop automating this worker and get them to actually just build a road to uh, my capital here. Yeah, we did have a road there, hey? Okay. Cool stuff. Uh, you can just alert. Our culture is now exotic to Arabia. Does that mean that's a good thing, right? I'm rather influential over Israel, but that's about it. That's my victory progress, but I don't know how to see their victory progress. Vassal. Vassal benefits. Still have the best GNP in the world, which makes a lot of sense, considering just how much gold I have. Um, I could spawn a whole army in one turn with the amount of gold I have. So yeah, I think I'll probably just pile up the gold for now and spend it on, like, wonders and stuff. All my cities are growing next turn. It's going to be a big science boost. The Celts have a global monopoly on Jade. Not once I'm done with them. Let's see. 
Everybody's guarded against me now, right? Yeah. And you're hostile towards me. Well, I can definitely say the same towards you. Pretty soon you'll just be nothing, actually. Yeah, huge growth here. I think I took a turn off of our thing here, so that's nice. Um, do I... Okay, I think the main attack's gonna come from this side, so... Yeah. Uh, I guess I'll start the road here. Just trying to think of where to put this long swordsman, I guess. We'll go here. Is that a. S no, that's just a fort, right? Not a citadel. We can just get in there and pillage it, and it should be good. Uh, we'll send three boys down here. So we'll attack them with six long swordsmen, which is going to be kind of out of control, but. Oh, we don't have a road to the city yet either, hey? Okay? So we need a... We need a couple workers. We have a worker for here. Okay, yeah, so once he's done this road, I'll have him build the road down here. And then, uh... Yeah, okay. And then one, two, three, four. And then have him work the tiles in here as well. Uh, and I'm... Yeah, I think I've decided I'm keeping the city now. I'll wait for the approval rating to go up a bit, though. It's mostly from, yeah, population and occupied cities. I'm building courthouses for that, though. Some urbanization stuff they don't like. Three specialists, no urbanization. Oh, okay, so they want, they want specialists? Is that it? I guess that's gotta be it. Yeah, I really don't care about cultural influence and stuff. Uh, okay. What unit needs orders now? Sure. Uh, we're gonna put you over here. We're gonna steer away from the Russians for some time now. And you know what? I mean, I can keep track of this, but let's just... Let's just let them do what they're going to do at this point. We can have five units for this city when we invade, which will be right after Israel, I think. And we'll send the Emissary down to Prague. Yeah, Zanzibar loves me and is going to for quite some time. I'm still building them a road. They also, same thing here. And I'm, I'm pumping emissaries out too, so. I've got two paper in rotation for that. I'm making great diplomats and all sorts of good stuff. I'm gonna finish this wonder next turn. Next turn's a big turn. Oh, you can actually see their names. The Republic of Arabia. I don't even know, like, four of the other players yet, I think. What I do know is I'm about to kill one of them. Israelite chiefdom, yeah. They're just really behind, eh? Even me, I'm not doing that great on technology, but I'm absolutely destroying these guys. The reputation and history of- I forgot they had just like some dude voice that over and it's so loud. Uh, let's look at what that was, because I started it last time. Oh yeah, a lot of production, science, and culture. Great scientist, but yeah, that's crazy. Plus 10 combat strength for iron units, I think? Am I right on that? Captives of war. Oh, okay, sure. Oh yeah, right, because this is the thing from the eagle, right? Military kills generate culture equivalent to 50... Oh, yeah, sure. Discipline. I don't even know. 
What I do know is I have a lot of uh, military buffs on this on these guys. I'll get him to heal this turn. Send that great general in. And I'm almost ready to go to war. Ten turns for sure. Or I guess it'd be more like eleven because I'd want to promote this guy to a crossbowman instead. But. Uh, and then you. I think honestly I'll have you build the road the other way here. You're fine to just sit there. I'll have you come back. So happen to be traveling together. I think I burn this one down and maybe this one too and take this one and this one. This is like a good strategic city, but I don't know if like I don't know if I really want it. <laughs> it's just kind of gross. It's gross desert terrain. I must have a... Monopoly on something, right? Yes, uh, cinnamon. Cool. And silver as well. So, okay, so some of them are like plus two culture. Oh, damn, that's nice. Oh, no, I don't quite have a monopoly. Okay. Russia has a huge monopoly on gold. That's really got to help them. Um, okay, but I'm close to having a monopoly on cinnamon, I guess. Interesting. Okay, then. We're back at 100% approval rating, so that's nice. They're protecting Yerevan. That's funny. Could have sworn you were at war with them not too long ago. I wonder if I can build up any sort of uh, ties with anybody here. Eagle sent to Prague. Yes, of course. And they're at war with Sana right now. Which is interesting. How much do they love me now? A lot, as it turns out. These guys built their circus. Uh, you can just sit there. Is that a settler? That's a worker, I think. And I think I want to send the general this way, actually. Which is why I... Okay, yeah. Little, little mistake there, but whatever. I think I'll just put the longswordsman there. And then I'll get you started on the road here. Or was it here? I think here is a better looking road. I'll just crescent it like this, maybe. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that, that's probably a nice looking road. Uh, what are you up to? You just finished a farm? I guess that means you're going to... Go here? I don't even know. Oh, right. Uh, we, I wanted to build a road, didn't I? I don't even know what's going on with most of my construction projects anymore. Alright. Uh, you'll be good here. Hey, Godsworth, how's it going? How's Martin's stream going? Uh, where is... Where was I sending this guy? Oh, I was just pulling him back from here. He keeps screaming. <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. I don't think that game is even that scary, but... Maybe he's playing it up a bit.
Who knows? I plan on playing it at some point. Maybe I'll change my mind. Fair enough, fair enough. Thanks for the follow again, by the way. He does have some funny screams, though. Road to Zanzibar, finally, at long last. So they love me. He sounds like a goat. <laughs> I can see it. I can kind of, I'm kind of like picturing it or hearing it in my head right now. You have this way of comparing people to things, it seems. First it was the old lady, and now it's the goat. Uh, right, I'm making you do a road, yes. Scream scared your cat? Oh, you had the volume turned up? <laughs> but anything scares a cat, to be fair. Ask me how I know. Um, okay, you're done here. I guess I'll just replace the worker then. I'll just have him go, like, frickin' here, I guess. He got tricked into thinking he was muted. Oh, you- <laughs> did you trick it? You, you made him think he was muted? I have two cats of my own. That is how I know. It's weird though, over the years they've like reversed personalities. They uh... One of them was always scared of everything at the beginning, now he's gotten old and very cuddly. And just like probably way too trusting for a cat. And the other one is like... Just... Completely distrustful and freaking out all the time. I think something's wrong with him, but I can't really... Put my uh... My finger on it. Oh yeah, I need to do a save, just in case this game crashes. Yes, yeah, so they're souls. They do soul transfer. It's a beautiful noise. I think that is that the expanding a border noise, or is that the uh, population growth noise? I don't even know. They do witchcraft when I'm asleep. I wouldn't be surprised, to be honest. I feel like they might be just well. At least one of them is just smart enough to do that. Oh, actually, you know what? That would explain a lot of things. Because if the cat that is, uh, like, cuddly and trustful now is smart enough to, um, like, he's definitely the smarter one. And if he's smart enough to do witchcraft, then he's probably also smart enough to be like, you know what, I would live a better life if I was just, like, more trustworthy and, like, you know, enjoyed the company of people. So he was like, you know what, I'm gonna steal his soul. Your cat got replaced? Your cat got soul... soul swapped? Uh... what was I... oh yeah, the road is built now. This is gonna be a wacky road though. I guess I'll just build one road here and then it connects to Jerusalem and that's gonna be really scuffed, but... sure. Uh, for now, do nothing. He opens door. What, like, he's able to, like, manipulate his paws to, like, turn the knob, or does he just, like, run into it? Because that's what mine does. Oh, God. That would scare me like crazy at night if I heard that or something. I 
at least the first couple times, and I'd be like, oh, like, I'd recognize the voice, and I'd be like, oh, it's just the cat. It'd scare people that I have over, though. That's actually, <laughs> that's actually kind of scary, too. Being able to turn the knob of the door. I feel like my cats would... Are you kidding me with this, Russia? I knew he was going to settle a city up there, but... Jesus Christ, another one? It's You don't learn. I took these two cities from him, and he just keeps doing it. But anyways, like, yeah, my cats are probably smart enough to, uh... To do it, but uh, the doorknobs are so high up that I'd, they can't get up there. If they had a stool, maybe. Okay, what's going on here? A mine shaft uh, has begun filling with liquid. Bury the compromised branch of the mine and enters the pillage state. To receive one oil. Oh, yeah, that's later. Whatever, it gets pillaged, so be it. Unfortunate, but not not a big deal. Okay, what's main city doing here? Doesn't need to be doing anything for a few turns. Um, I don't even want to make eagles anymore, because I just gotta promote them. Maybe a trebuchet. I'll make one trebuchet. Why not? And you can just go to sleep. And you're gonna build the road. And you're just gonna do stuff in this city now. I guess you're gonna construct a village. And this will be the Celtic Invasion Army. You can also sleep. I don't know, maybe... Uh, should I just go for it and fight two wars at once? This is a good bit of units they have here now, though. I want these guys to be crosswomen first. I think I might be starting to underestimate the capabilities of, uh... Some of these nations. I'll have you join up with the ranks here. And I was going to annex you. I'll buy that, because why not? I guess I can do this. Makes that a lot easier, actually. I mean, if you're going to make the walls, make the walls. Eighty-four percent approval rating isn't bad. Borbadur. Yeah, you're gonna need it with how bad your uh, religion is. I don't think it'll save you, though. Where's Russia gonna put this stupid city? I'm guessing, like, right here or something. Actually, yeah, right on this tile. That would be my... Ah, oh, shit. Well. Time to go. Oh, and it crashed. And I didn't save. Son of a bitch. But I think it was turn 160 just then, so not too, uh, not too bad of a setback. Oh, thanks for joining the Discord, I just noticed. Codsworth, if you're still here. Uh, okay. Awesome. You're still- you, you made it longer than my game did, so... Congrats for that. I think I was at turn like 161, so it auto-saves every 10 turns, which means I might be set back like a turn, which isn't too bad.
Okay, this music's too peaceful, though. Oh, why isn't my music switching? That's better. Now, question is, is it recording? Yes, okay, awesome. Let's see. Yeah, 160. Don't think it was too bad. What crashed it? Oh, me declaring war. That's totally what it was. Well, 45 minutes without a crash. That's, uh, I can't say that's a new record, but... Okay, how far back did I go? Oh, uh, like, not that far. We'll do this. I'll build the walls first. I'll save right before I declare war. Although, to be fair, he did just kind of come at me with that, uh, with that accusation. Oh yeah, you're building the road. No, it appears not. I think it's just because, I don't know, it's running a lot of processes and uh, I, I honestly couldn't tell you. The, uh, the person that made this mod pack is sometimes in my chat. I gotta ask him about why it's crashing so much. It's been getting worse and worse with that, unfortunately. Uh, we were gonna send you to this city now. I think it's it's wars and um, it's just like diplomatic in general, like any sort of trade I do. can do is probably put this away here or put this guy back here I gotta bring up my science thing again I'll save right before I end this turn, if I remember. Uh, it'd be very unfortunate if I can declare any more wars, though. That's for sure. That's gonna be a nice army for the Celts to deal with, too. Uh, oh yeah, no, I'm gonna make you sleep. Okay, uh, yes, next turn I will save now. And let's hope it doesn't do it again. Calls him this obvious, um, preparation of war. I don't think he... Oh, hold on. No, not that. But now he's got all of his forces ready. He knows. Oh yeah, and I just got like a shit in there. Interesting. Yeah, the mine thing again. I guess I gotta just save every turn. Can I set that to happen? Uh... Turns between autosaves. Here we go. One. <laughs> Max autosaves kept. Uh, three.
That's probably a good idea. Okay. So now it should auto save every turn, and that way I won't be in hell if I uh, crash. Okay. You. Wait, what is going on? Oh, I sent you to do the dumb thing here. Okay, whatever then. Do this. Build the road. This is one mighty looking army. I'm kind of thinking I might want to just go to war with the Celts too. But then my middle area here is kind of unguarded, so... Yeah, I don't know what they're doing with that guy. But it's almost like Russia just wants me to kill them. They're egging me on every time. They settled these two cities, and now they're settling two up here. It's like, come on. Oh, interesting. The mine was the uh, this one this time. Which is actually quite annoying, because I need that iron. So I'm actually going to get you to repair that before doing anything. Yep, that's the... Uh, that's the mentality. If they want to die, then let them. I don't know what Yerevan's doing with their military. I'd be very interested to know what's going on up here, though. Because I think they got another city. Uh, do city-states want anything from me? Glass, not gonna happen. Maybe eventually. I don't even know what that is. Oh, they want an eagle now. Okay, I'll send them an eagle. You know what? I'll buy an eagle and send them an eagle. How about that? Can I just do that right away? Let's see. Yes. There you go, Valetta. Take my eagle. Alright. When, at what point does it save? Probably like the end of the turn. I have a feeling he's going to call me out on this war here. And it might crash again. Yes, okay. Moment of tr No? I think we're okay. I think we're okay this time. What do you have? Mac Maccabi? Interesting. I have not crashed yet. Oh nice, my city can shoot uh, two tiles now. Okay, how's this going to go down then? Oh, I can hit this guy, that's nice. I'm going to run these knights right in here. Get that general in there too. Uh, take down this fort if I can. Even with all of those uh, fortifications and defensive bonuses, I still win. Slightly. And I guess you guys might as well get Blast in here. Uh, yep, gone. I think I want to pillage this fort, or maybe I can use it for myself, I don't know. Yeah, they have just nothing in comparison to me. I'm going to roll them over. Let's see. Maybe I'll build a second trebuchet here. And we'll just keep sending the emissaries. Do we want to send one to Prague or do we want to send one to Yerevan here? Definitely to Yerevan. Oh well. Uh, wait, which worker? Oh no, you're doing, you're doing your thing. Oh no, you're done your thing. No, you're not. Build the road. Don't care about religious thing. Um, don't think any of these cities stay. Oh, actually, no. Valetta might help me here. In time. The Celts are ahead. I need 32 influence. Uh, I think I'm going to be getting that. Uh, 
Might as well keep the units and just uh, sell them if they're that bad. Yes, I know, I know. The iron isn't good. A lot of faith that I can't really use. Give me an order. Uh, yeah, no, you're fine there. Let's see what they do. They don't even have any ranged boats, as far as I know. And now uh, you're Islamic. Very cool. Arabia is definitely winning the religious game. Oh, they finally got into the medieval era. Well, good for them. Depends with what, but uh, could be a problem, I suppose. Well, they just ran a caravan right into me. Do these guys heal when they get killed? Because they were... Um, they were eagles? Oh, they do. That's actually kind of insane. <laughs> Okay, um, that's a little ridiculous. So they heal. Wow, that is kind of nasty. In the best of ways. Uh, I guess these guys are just auto-healing, I don't know. Seems like it. I don't mind them being at full health, though. As much as possible. I guess maybe I can bring Valletta under my, uh, my influence here. I'll send emissaries out that way. And you can just chill. Russia and the Celts have signed a research agreement. Oh yeah, that's right. When I go to war with the Celts, I'm going to go to Russia because they have a defensive pack too. I remember that. Iron, Faith, a whole bunch of bonuses. Cool. Keep building the road, man. Nobody's going to hurt you. For now. Fortify... Wait, do you... Okay, you know what? Let's just destroy this. Yeah. I was wondering if that fort maybe had something to do with it. I think it does. If only slightly. Okay. Uh, that's all done. I'm getting two trebuchets next turn. Supply cap is going off the screen. I think it's just because of how much gold I have, though. An actual insane amount. So much gold, I don't even know what to do with it. Just buy some buildings, I guess. Plundering caravans, very nice. So probably three turns until machinery. I'm aware that I need iron, yes. Next turn I'll have it. Uh, let's see. I guess uh, just be a better population city here. Same with you for two turns. And then you can build, I don't know, a wonder of some sort against ranged attacks uh, yeah that might be good good against attacking cities cover against ranged attacks get in there we'll rule you out let's 
Something tells me these guys aren't ever gonna have a bad time here. Um, oh, they didn't quite do it, eh? Absolutely rolling them right now. They have all these triremes, but that's not going to really do much for them in the end. Um, and I'll just chill here for a sec. I don't know why I don't have the option to heal. Not sure what that's about. And we got yet another trebuchet against ranged and into the cities. I think I'll probably just send him over here. No, I guess I'll get you each to build a new trebuchet instead, actually. Screw that. Take the next two turns to make a trebuchet. Or four, in that case. Now, Valetta's at war with them. Uh, they also have Long Swordsman, which is interesting. Yeah, I need the tech. I need the tech bad here. Very cool, Dublin. Uh, just all the bonus yields in the world. Finish that road. I mean, I don't know if you can't he like. Why can't you heal? Is the thing. Oh, is it because we don't have enough iron? Is that why? What about now? Ah, I figured it out. And that applies to my whole army? Or just the long swordsman? I'm gonna assume the long swordsman. Still rough though. Okay. Very interesting. I think I have the most populous city in, well, at least the known world right now. Yeah, definitely. Hurting my long swordsman. That's not very nice. I think I gotta keep him here for a couple more turns just to uh, make him a crossbow man. Or I guess one more. New automatic faith selection since I've already built all the orders in the world, but I don't really need them, so. Oh, we're just completely boxing them in now. I guess I can just do this. And I actually heal off of that. And then you can just chill. Uh, give you drill and you can heal. You can actually come out here now. And you can continue the road. And you can start the road on this end. And we'll roll in the trebuchet. Yeah, this is... I think this is over already. Something tells me. Get rid of that damn fort. And I guess I took a worker as well, which is fine, because... Uh, We'll use them in Jerusalem here after we take it. Jesus. Just a lot of faith everywhere for winning a battle. But I don't even need it. Literally do not even need it. I think I might be catching up on policies. Yeah, I definitely am. Technology is really what I need though, so I'll probably go uh, rationalism. When's the industrial era? Oh yeah, I'll probably have most of that statecraft one filled out by the industrial era, so... That'll work. But then again, I might also get my ideology at that point, so... Who knows? Okay, uh... Just skip turn. Stay there for one. 
What are you up to? Building farms? I guess build one on this side now. I don't know. Send this guy up to Valletta. Sure, go through there. I have a feeling this war will be almost over in four turns. And you're going... Honestly, here's fine. Just stay. There you go. Gotta stay ahead of the Arabians on their uh, influences and stuff. Which means after that, it's time for you to make an emissary. feeling they're gonna try to kill this guy. I don't know if they'll succeed, I kind of doubt it. Chand Bayori. Isn't that something that uh, one of these guys wanted me to build? Did they even hurt me there? What happened? Oh, you fool. I guess I won't be promoting this guy this turn. Or actually, no. I, I totally will. Just do it. We got crosswomen now. Okay, we'll put you over here. Uh, we're gonna have to deal with that somehow, but... No idea. You can heal for a turn, that's fine. Yet another trebuchet here. Speaking of, bonk. You guys can just all heal for now. Ironworks or public works? What is this? Increases the city's gold maintenance by two every time it's constructed. Uh, is this because I need a... Wait, ironworks requires six more national citizens to be constructed. What does that mean? Oh, does that mean I literally just need six more population? Or six more in the city? No idea. Okay then, um... Happiness in the city by one. I don't really care about that. I think I'll just farm. Now I'm getting some of these old techs, right? Can't build a crack de chevalier. At least not here. No idea. Uh, let's do one of these, one of these. Sure. And you're done your road there? No, you're not done your road. Then do the road. Don't think I should attack here necessarily. Uh, yes, build a farm here, please. I'm just growing like crazy now. Oh, well, now these guys apparently have more gold than me. Yeah, I'm about to take literally the worst sieve out of the game, but I kind of did it to them in the first place. I have four city-state allies, which is kind of crazy. Alright. Oh, I guess I didn't declare war on, uh... Or I didn't denounce these guys before declaring war, but he kind of asked that of me, so... Yeah, yeah. The whole world hates me, but I don't know if there's much they can do about it. Okay. 
You won't be alive for much longer, but sure, man. Oh, interesting. Okay. Market today. And they've moved this guy over, which is probably a very bad error for them. Yeah, uh, okay, this one will crash my... G <laughs> Speaking of crashing my game. Uh, this one here, resource I... Oh wait, no, that's that. Uh, yield icons. Yeah, do you think it's better with this on or off? I personally like seeing them because I like knowing what I can get on these tiles, but yeah. No problem. Yeah, gotta agree. It is definitely better. Uh, let's see. Where's this worker going? Oh yeah, he's just chilling because we're taking the city. Uh, I think I'll just heal you. But now we can get into the the siege here. Speaking of, oh, I thought this was Siege of Jerusalem. Honestly, I should play Siege of Jerusalem right now. Hold on. I think there's a song called Siege of Jerusalem in my playlist or something like that. Jerusalem. Saladin arrives. Uh, Saladin besieged Jerusalem. Let's let's listen to this one. Let's see. Is this a good song? I don't even know. This is pr pretty unintense for a song that's about a siege so far. Uh, okay, I'm not gonna trade with the Russians. I will trade with Valletta, though. This is not e exactly the safest trade route. Although it will be pretty safe. Uh, I know, Prague. Where does Prague go? Well, that's good. Um, this is a, this is like a mod pack, so this is Fox Populi mod pack, so this is definitely not the base game or anything. Uh, so it's got a bunch of like UI mods, so that's why like everything looks so different. And um, yeah. I think I can get away with this maybe. Yeah, the uh, creator, or I guess the creator of like the specific mod pack is often in the chat here, so I don't think he's around today, but uh, if you have any questions, I could ask him, because I have my own questions. Uh, let's see. Who am I sending this trebuchet to? What am I even doing? Where are all these trebuchets coming from? Okay, this is the one I'm looking at. I have one here. Oh yeah, no, I'll send two here. Yes, okay. Uh, a whole bunch of denouncing, I don't care. The world can think what they want of me. Does not matter. Thanks for the follow, Iskata, by the way. I appreciate it. You're gonna try this mod out today? Because I think, I don't think this mod is on, um, or this mod pack is on, like, the workshop. I'm sure this UI mod specifically is on there, but... I don't know what any of it is called. I just know Vox Populi mod pack. It was, like, a download on some, um, unrelated website or something. Ok, 
Okay, let's hope this guy doesn't die. Yeah, I know you hate me, Russia. Very well. Never tried any mods, so you're gonna check today. Sounds good. I'd recommend is uh, the Red World War II mod. You get to play as like any of the major nations during World War II, so you can play as uh, like Hitler, you can play as Stalin, you can play as um, what is it, Charles de Gaulle, the French leader. Uh, that's that one's definitely worth a look too. And it play it completely overhauls the game too, but it's very fun. Oh, this is a very promoted um, unit now. I will take cover. Alright, the siege begins. Oh, these assholes got behind me now, didn't they? Well, shit. Uh, let's do... This, then, I guess. That is problematic for sure. Is this the damage the city did to me, or is this the damage these guys did to me? Because if they only did that much damage, I'm not really too worried about it. Uh, let's get this guy in here, and then we can roll the trebuchet up. And send the emissary in there. You guys can all just heal. I'm just gonna automate improvements on this one. Oh, apparently I have a skirmisher now. You know what? That works. Uh, I will f fight this skirmisher with it. Ranged combat strength, uh, at or below or above. Oh, I can do both though, I'm guessing. Yeah. Alright. That guy might actually get real useful there. And you can build a farm. Let's see. I think we're good. This is looking pretty damn menacing around Jerusalem. I'd be shitting my pants right now if I lived in there. Hopefully they don't kill my crossbowman. He's been alive a long time. I don't think they can though. I guess maybe if they bomb it and... Yeah. <laughs> okay, they did it. Oh shit, my great general was there too, wasn't he? Oh no, he's there. Never mind. Okay, we're fine. What is drama? Unfortunate though. Um, they did the old switcheroo on me there. Uh, yeah. Do this instead. We'll get rid of farming now. Arts. Ooh, I kind of want the culture, actually. That's kind of nice. I'm glad that I'm able to do that now. After you do that, build me a new crossbowman, please. Alright. I don't really know how to use those units yet, but sure. Hopefully I can kind of, uh... screw with these guys a bit. These are all costly attacks, unfortunately. They have it well defended. The Aztec Holy Empire. <laughs> I just have a lot of faith, that's all. I guess I'm building... what are amphitheaters? 
Oh, okay, sure. You, as long as I'm using the faith for something, I guess. I just have so much of it. I think an excess of resources is usually a good problem to have, though. Um, I guess I'll send my boy over here. Get this emissary out of here. You're actually done the road now. Finally. This is a huge siege army getting ready for this. I'm loving it. I'm going to have two trebuchets firing on the uh, city now. Or at the very least, soon. Oh, and I'm just realizing they rebuilt this... Uh... Okay. These guys are going a little too crazy in here for me. They actually won't be firing on the city for today. I'm not even sure what the city is shooting at right now, by the way. Oh, R Russia has supplanted me by seven influence. Not for long. Alright, now run. Next turn, I will deal with that. Um... Yeah, that's, you can send right there, that's fine. And we'll have you, oh, another great general. That's exactly what I needed. Now we're going crazy. All right, and then you can just eat him for some health and voila. All right. The siege is going well. You can stay back at your city here. Uh, let's get this iron going, actually. We need it to promote all our units. Damascus. I don't think so. I think we're going to start trading with city-states now. Uh, Prague will do. Oh, here's an interesting question that I guess I'm going to have answered today. If I go to war with the Celts, they're in a defensive pact with Russia. Do the Arabians get involved, or, yeah, do the Arabians get involved because they're a vassal? This I do not know. Uh, you finished your arena, hey? Then how about we do, like, a little... ...bit of this stuff, you know? Just, like, all of it. Every single one. Maximum of three of these buildings in my empire. Alright, noted. Yeah. So basically, when I do my planned war against the Celts here, I'm gonna be at war with the whole fucking world. But, uh, I do have four city-state allies, so that'll help me. Especially this guy right in the center here. And him. Hmm. So maybe the smart move would actually be to declare war on Arabia first. Because then that is the only situation where the Celt, or all three of them aren't involved, right? So I declare war directly on Russia, that, uh, that brings them in. And them. But then at least if I declare war on them, it'll just be them and Russia. Interesting. Okay. Maybe that's the move then. Uh, as for you, I just want to send you to Zanzibar. Can I send you to Zanzibar? Or maybe I already have one going there. This is true, but I'm also going to get access to the coast here. Yeah, okay, I think that might be the plan. But I think I also need to upgrade my tech more before I even start on that. 
because these uh, 22 strength longswordsmen aren't going to do it against this kind of city, especially with the Great Wall. I really need to do something about my tech because I'm quite behind. Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, right. This is what I was looking at. So why this weird-ass route through Arabia to Prague? Why not just go, like, through the desert? I think maybe I'll just... No, wait, this guy's allied to Arabia, so... And that goes right through Russian lines. Okay, well, you know what? Let's do Prague. Screw it. It's not going to be for some time that I go to war with Arabia anyways, probably. All this faith stuff. I think these guys are running out of units. This trebuchet will heal next turn because of a promotion. Long swordsman is getting hit. Which one? Uh, yes, that would make sense. I got a fort to pillage, though. So have fun doing that again and wasting your time. Uh, yes, more attacking cities. Thank you. Alright, Jerusalem is not looking so hot anymore. But it's still very hard to get in here. I think I'll do this one, though. They're trying to chase me down over here. They didn't quite get to me, though. I will now be good friends with Valletta. Even better friends. Oh, apparently I can pillage again. Oh, the caravan. Wait, what? What did I do? Okay. Uh, Writer's Guild. I would say this would be a place for a Writer's Guild. One of my three best cities, for sure. Uh, apparently I'm just getting pikemen now? Oh, right. I guess I can afford to have the city guards here. Um... Put one in, uh, I don't know, somewhere else. Oh, just because Dublin got it. Okay, I see. We'll send this one to Earth Capital or something then. Huh, I just don't know who to attack first. I guess maybe I should be on the lookout for that uh, defensive pack to end, because it was made some time ago at this point. So maybe if that, uh, once that pact ends, I should just declare war right away on, uh, Russia. For those two cities, knock them out. I think I'll just burn them to the ground. Try to take St. Petersburg too, maybe. Um, okay, so instead of doing whatever wacky shit I'm doing right now, I should probably go for this guy. No, just, hold on. Uh, yeah, these guys. Maybe right for metallurgy? And then I can go for... Maybe right to scientific theory? So five, six, seven, eight... Yeah, that seems more... Appropriate for what I'm doing. Uh, oh, you guys go for it too. You'll get a little yellow, but that's fine.
And you're just gonna do your thing, which is shoot and run away. Three units are kinda nice, I'm not gonna lie. And the road's built. Supposedly. Does this road connect? Because then we have a connection here too. Looks like it. Oh no, you're building the uh you're building the mine. Keep going on that. And then you're gonna build another emissary. Looks like Yerevan needs a uh emissary here. Let's see what they do to this guy this turn. Hopefully nothing, but Fair enough. Oh. Damn. Wonder if I could step up here and then shoot. Probably. Oh, and so can my city itself. We'll just heal you all up. Yeah, he's getting a little beat up here, but that's fine. I'll just send him here. He can heal. It'll be all good. Meanwhile... Well, I guess I am taking on a level 39, or a combat strength 39 city here, but um, they also have out-of-date units and stuff. They're not really doing much. They can't send too much at me at once. Yeah, you're done. I wonder if I get any like crazy special bonuses for um, taking an enemy capital. I feel like I must, but who knows. Uh, apparently I built a cross of men here, which does sound right, actually. Uh... Yeah, I guess I want the farming too, though, for the science. I don't know. Maybe this will be... Oh yeah, this will be my science capital, and this can be my arts capital, and I can switch him to arts when he's done whatever he's doing. That seems fair. Okay. Um, what are we doing here? Oh yeah, one of each is usually the way to go. I don't think I need to send him here anymore. I should send him to, um... I guess this will be another front line on the Celtic War. Or actually, I guess when that defensive pact ends, I want to attack the Celts, really, right? So, let's just build that up. And another policy already. I'm getting those faster. Uh, one or addition, more additional spies based on the number of city-states in game. Um, plus one of every three, or strategic resource for every three city-state alliances you maintain. That's nice. Uh, great diplomats faster, or... Uh, oh yeah, this is really good too. Damn, those are both really good. But I think having this consistently generate um, influence is really nice. Okay, traders to city-states generate plus one influence per turn with the target city-state for each own city-state trade route. Oh shit, so if I... Yeah, okay, that's insane. If I have five city-state trade routes going, then I get plus five with each one of them per turn. That's insanity. Letter than me. Oh, fuck you, Arabia. Time to send another emissary up there, I guess. Uh, I'll just send the next one I build. Are they going for. Yeah, they're going for statecraft too, huh? 
An interesting duality of my social policies. Six on authority and I'm building statecraft now too. I think my uh, trade routes are going to... Yeah, Prague and Zanzibar. Two of which I am trying to be in control of. And then where's the other one? Wait, what's going on? Why do I only have two going, apparently? Prague and Zanzibar. Is one going out of this city or something? What am I missing here? Because it says I have three out of three, so I don't know. Or maybe I have to set one up this turn and I didn't notice? I don't know. Uh, you're good there. Actually, yeah, why don't we just throw you in a garrison? Why not? Just get him in the damn city. Make him stronger. And I think I get bonuses for having garrisons too. Uh, this should resolve any approval issues I have. Well, here they go. Probably better that they declared war on me, though. But very well. Uh... Uh, okay. <laughs> Not great. This could be an issue for sure. But I do have all these city-state allies, so... That could be... Oh, now I'm at war with Valletta now, too, eh? Uh, sorry, buddy. I, I'm still gonna kill you. Unless you capitulate. I will, I will allow capitulation. Alright, well... Uh, we have a lot of problems, though, for sure. I think Russia... Uh, Yerevan's just gonna have to fend for themselves over here. I think that's just how it's gonna be. Most prosperous civilizations. Oh my god, who has this? That's insanity. We must be the poor continent here. Yeah, Valletta's looking a little scary here. Jesus Christ, what did Arabia do? Oh, never mind, it's because I'm at war. It's not because they have that much influence. Okay, let's uh, get in here. Alright, so I'm thinking uh, it's probably not the time to not be making units anymore. I'm thinking it's more of a, uh, you know, get Jerusalem taken care of and uh, pray kind of deal now. I think I can shoot and run here, right? Yes. Quite effectively, too. Uh, since the city-state's probably going to be a big pain in my ass, I'll probably want to just pull the guards from... Wait, why are you not... Oh. Yeah, no, get that going right now. Then again, I probably want the guards... Okay. I've got to evaluate what's most valuable here. Um... Okay, I have a whole army here, so I'm not too worried about that. I think maybe I should start moving on the city, though. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I'm at war with the world. Okay. Um. Huh. This is getting interesting. We have walls in here. Oh, we can make this wonder now, too, eh? But where? Can we make it only there? Because I'm on a hill, maybe? Oh no, here too. Probably better to try and make it over here, then. I'll spend, I'll spend some of my 5,000 gold on that. Um, Jesus. 
I am uh, scared. I can make the oracle there. Apparently. Fine, let's make the damn oracle then. Actually, I probably should have read what it even does for me. Science and culture is good. Free temple might be nice too. I know this one is good for me. Yeah, free great general. Love to see that. Okay, uh, we need to be just spamming out uh, units at this point though. I think honestly getting some of these skirmishers is probably the way to go, just because I can run them all over my territory. Annoyingly, I can't shoot over here. Um, or into the jungle, rather. Oh, I can do this, though. Oh, nice. Alright. One done. Uh, apparently I'm missing iron here. Did something get trampled that I'm not seeing? Oh no, it's because I had a deal with Russia for iron, right? So now these guys can't actually heal, which is a huge problem in and of itself. Shit. Okay. Uh, I am making a mine here, though, for more iron. I think we stay in there. You've taken your shot, so run the hell out of there. I think I actually just need the skirmishers right now. I'll make literally three of them, I think. Unfortunate that they turned Valletta against me. I'll probably use the skirmishers mostly up here. As for this army, I'm wondering, should I have them try to defend, or should I just, like... Because I think I've got Zanzibar here for defense, really. Faith Terim. I have no idea what that means. Is that a building? Uh... Huh. Oh, these guys can't heal. Son of a bitch. That is actually like a pretty brutal aspect of my situation, I guess. Uh, let's try. I think I'm gonna just go for... Uh, Nantes here. Galatasaray's coach. Old. I still have... I have no idea still. Are you... Are you speaking English, sir? Are you alright? Okay. Well, I definitely need to stay allied to people, if I can. I don't know if I can get this emissary in there, though. Zanzibar is essential. Everybody hates me. Fell in mine. I think for my own good I need to destroy Jerusalem soon. Um, hopefully I can do that in a decent amount of time. I guess if I need to pillage, I'll pillage. Uh, You like civilization, but you do not have money. So instead you must watch it. Well, you've come to the right place, so. Alright, two great generals. Uh, I guess I'm probably gonna put the third one over here, actually. I see. Yes, that makes sense. Now I'm understanding you. Uh, 
let's see, above 50, yeah, but maybe I'll just get cover. Oh yeah, I guess crossbow men would be nice too, I should get those out. Skirmishers, the artist guild. I kinda need the emissaries still too though. This is a rough situation I'm in, that's for sure. I can't build a farm here, so... I guess I'll build a... M oh wait, no, that's a farm, so this will be a village then. And you can't even heal, which ain't good. I'll keep you within my borders. Yeah, I think I've got a pillage, unfortunately. I didn't want to have to do it, but if I must. I can run this guy out, perfect. Hopefully I can get this done in a couple turns. You'll just have to heal. Uh, I don't even know. Russia's gonna be up here too? My god. Alright. This is what they call a problem. I guess I'll throw him here. Let's see what everybody does this turn. Every turn is gonna be scary. These guys are just gonna be dickheads and attack me every time, right? An Arabian Knight's coming too. Very nice. Oh god. Run. Run, emissary. A trip. Damn it, they're going for the units that actually matter. Although I should be able to pillage this and shoot as well, so that's something. Kingdom of Bulk. Okay, Valetta's backing off. That's good to see, at least. Um, damn. I can't shoot over there. They pillaged my horses, which I don't really care about at all. Okay, so I think I can pillage and then still shoot, right? Yes. Good. More strength when attacking cities? Yes, please. Uh, let's do this then. Throw you up here. Even if it's a costly attack, I kind of need to do it now. I need to wrap this war up fast. Can I plunder that uh, caravan? Maybe. Let's see. Anybody making moves against me? A bit in the south. Uh, you're also getting close and I don't like it. I've got enemies all around me. This'll do. Very unfortunate that I have an iron deficit right now. Russia and Arabia scare me a lot. Maybe I, you know what, I think I'm going to use this army defensively. I think I've changed my mind here. I'll throw you in the, in here. And I'll fight on the hills. I can't, I can't be affording to go and uh, try to... do all of that. Okay, got a village. Uh, let's see. Get more bananas. I don't think I want to go there, though. Uh, 
Here's fine. Can I? No, I can't shoot them from there. I figure not. Over a mountain seems a little rough. You can heal at least. Uh, I could shoot a caravan, but I don't think I need to be doing that. I think I'll send this crossbow man in here. Fortify, I guess. Yeah, I really just need these, uh, this iron to be built. Seven turns till I can heal any of my long swordsmen, which is just brutal. Alright. What now? Sana? Okay. Oh, suddenly there's just a knight in here. But I can actually do something about that. I'm just sending guys right at my capital, I guess. Zanzibar's doing a good job of protecting itself. Same with Yerevan. I don't know why you would send a guy right in there, but hey. More power to you, I guess. Jerusalem is going right for my trebuchet every time. I hate it. They know. They know that it's the thing to take out. Oh, great. Now you guys are coming in. Okay, maybe I gotta send these guys out here and spread them out a bit. I'll give these guys a, uh... Well, I kinda have to attack and move here, don't I? They're surrounding me here, too. Minor victory across the board here, apparently. I don't even know what you should do. Um... I guess they're all saying walls. Only one allowed per player on this. Uh, don't care about faith, really. Sure, you know what? Walls it is. You fortify up, you're good in the city. Um, I guess you guys can keep going for it here. Eventually we'll get in there. Might take us a turn or two, but we'll get there. One day. Getting kind of desperate though. Oh, I guess I can just go in here. What did you even get hit by? No idea. Alright, Yervan, or sorry, Zanzibar, take your emissary.
You can also take an emissary. Hmm. You're making a road. No, you're making a road. You're just here. Go just automate. I don't care. Do what you're gonna do. I think I'll send some eagles this way. I just have no idea what to do in this situation. I know I gotta take out Jerusalem. I think then I'll probably move on to these cities, maybe? I can close that front off. Kind of. Yerevan will... Well, actually, no, that's a good idea, because then I can keep Yerevan on my side. Well, nobody's even a contender here, which is amazing. Uh, yeah, take 200 gold, man. Improve your... I don't know. Pearls? Oh, no, it's the... Yeah, definitely do that. Oh, I've crashed the game by doing that. <laughs> okay. Hold on. I'm running it back. Maybe I'll have better luck this time. It should have been auto saving every turn, so. capturing right now. Game. There we go. Yeah, I really gotta ask uh, DJ about what's going on with this. Uh, okay. 176. Should be pretty close to where I was. The whole world is at war with me, but being at war is where I thrive with this sieve, so... Speaking of, I should probably see what, uh kind of war score I've got against everyone here. I mean, obviously against you it's high, yeah. But I don't really care about that. I'm going to... It looks like I'm just running my turn here, right? So, give me both of those. Shoot him, get out. Go in, shoot him, and I'm gonna just send you over here. Fortunately, I can't shoot there, so I'll go here. Uh, this pikeman is the most vulnerable here. You're gonna fortify. Actually, I guess before anything, I should do what I was planning on doing, which is... There we go. It actually worked that time. Oh, I just realized I get that iron too. Oh, that's so awesome. Holy shit, that's actually like a game changer. Okay, now I can actually heal my units. Okay, we're back in business, boys. Um, can this swordsman kill him? Yes, which means I can eat his health. Okay, that's amazing. That's amazing that I can get that iron. Um, I think you just shoot, yeah. I think we're just gonna send it. Mostly. 
Yeah, you're good there. Um, you come out and protect the worker like I wanted you to do. Let's see. Uh, honestly, you can just sit here and heal. What are you? What is that? Looks like a melee unit. But if I'm fortified, I should be fine here. Or maybe, you know what, let's just put him here. That's a better idea. You're good there. You're chilling. We'll bring you up to the hill. Kill that knight if we can. Uh, let's see. Yeah, make walls. We were getting you guys to be a more defensive, or in a more defensive spot. I'm gonna send you an emissary. Uh, let's see. get these guys out of here. I think having this kind of array of defense here is good. So now I have three city-state allies, but that's okay. That's certainly enough, and they're certainly the ones that I want. Would be nice to have Valletta though now. Unfortunately, I didn't happen to be allies with them at the right time. And Jerusalem might even fall next turn if I'm lucky. Uh, I was right, I put you on automated. I think it might be good to just get you, actually maybe get you up here. I think I'll move my armies mostly like this way and try to cut... Oh, actually, yeah, that's totally the plan. Um, I'll fend these guys off here and here. I will take Jerusalem, then I will take these cities and uh, cut them off here so I have a defensive line here. Um, and then I can push through, maybe, into St. Petersburg if I'm lucky. Or uh, I could just hold them off here and push them or kill the Celts now. Or after, whatever. I think that's the plan. Uh, I don't know how many units I want to leave here, though. Maybe just a couple eagles. Maybe I'll just leave you... You and you, maybe? I'll put you, like, here, and then the trebuchet. I think that'll be enough. I don't see them sending that much here, so... And they're plundering my trade routes, but, you know, what can you expect? Um, do I even need all these heavy skirmishers? I think I'll get one more. And then I'll make caravans again. I'll try to send them down safe routes here. Uh, and then I'll also get another emissary. But I know, I do now have enough iron, is the thing. And I haven't even finished this yet. So... It's only going to get better. I have a, just a shit ton of iron. So does Russia, by the way, but I'm not too worried about it yet. They can pretty much only attack me with what they sent over here and what they might buy. Because um, Yerevan's kind of dealing, and also Zanzibar is kind of dealing with any reinforcements they're trying to send. And I'll also kind of cut them off here too. So yeah, uh, let's try this turn out. I've plundered 200 from whichever caravan. A knight attacked my pikemen. That generally isn't a smart thing. Yeah, whatever. Pillage my damn mines. I don't care. Uh, let's see. Looks like I might have to wheel this trebuchet out. You can fire. Oh, very 